Hey guys, it's just Demo here, and like I said, for my New Year's resolution, I'm uh, I'm gonna stop procrastinating, and I'm gonna basically just make my life better. I'm gonna do stuff that I've been wanting to do for a long time. So one thing that I've always hated throughout my life was reading. Um, I've always hated it, never wanted to do it, but I realized a big reason why is because I hated all the stuff I was forced to read. Um, one thing I am concerned about are my finances and stuff as I... Uh, go through life. I'm getting ready to get my first house. I just got my first major job. Just graduated from college. I had a huge year in 2018 and it was awesome. However, I'm planning on 2019 even being a bigger year and more exciting. Um, I got this book from my uncles and I'm, uh, I want to thank them for that. Um, I didn't ask for it or anything. They just sent it and it's it's actually looking like it's going to be a pretty cool book. Um, the reason why is as I flip through here, you can probably see there's like graphs. Um, there's stuff to go along with it. It's not just a bunch of jargon and it's it's not a real huge book. Um, I think I can get through it. One of my goals is to get through at least um, 12 books this year. So one, one a month. Um, while I'm doing that, I'd kind of like to give an overview of the of the book per chapter of what I thought of it, if I think it's helpful, if I think it's a good book. And one challenge I'm making to myself is even if I don't like the book, I'm going to finish it. Once again, I do not want to procrastinate. I don't want to put things off. I want to finish all my projects. So like I said, no matter what, I want to finish it. Um, so as we get in here, um, it, it has a, a cool little beginning, you know, everybody's saying, oh, this is a good book, this is a good book, this is a good book, um, you know, and then it goes on and on and on, just like all books do. And it actually, the cool thing, one of the awesome things I like about this is it has a, a, a table of contents in it that is very, very detailed. It tells you, you know, what page to go to, what it's going to be, and it's cool because even though that there's chapters, there's basically sub chapters in there. Um, they're really neat as you go through. Like I said, it's super, super detailed. Um, you can read the introduction. It's just saying basically, you know, 20s, 30s, um, your life's getting ready to start. Where do I even start? Is saving money easy? Is it hard? I'm going to answer all these questions in this book. Blah, blah, blah. That's basically what this says. So it also says, the, they recommend you read the whole book. Well, of course they do. They want good reviews. They want people to recommend it and everything else. But this awesome part, what this author did, I think it's a she, um, judging by the back here. Yeah, I believe it's a she. Um, she made these crib notes, which I've never heard of, but it's, it's really cool. Um, she goes through and she even says, like even right here, you can see spark notes. Um, so she, she refers to things that you, um, the viewers, and I probably use while we're going through school. Um, if you're in your 20s or 30s, you probably did all that stuff, you know, to help you get through not reading your books because you hated it kind of like I did. Um, and the awesome thing is about these crib notes is it tells you exactly what they're about and it kind of tells you the main points of everything the chapters what you need to go through see as it says the deductible what is a deductible and it's kind of awesome because it even tells you at the end of all these you know um if you having trouble with just this specific thing and you you know how to pay off your debt you know how to do whatever it's asking start contributing you know all that stuff it'll actually tell you hey just skip to chapter eight you can learn a lot like i said i'm gonna go through this whole book and kind of let you guys know but these crib notes are awesome. I mean, it tells you pages. It tells you how to start saving, where to save, um, just awesome things. And the best part is these crib notes, as you can see, are only 10 pages long. 10 pages right there. And the last one's barely anything. Um, get my bookmarker out of the way. So that was just my quick little overview. Um, I, I, I actually do recommend looking at those crib notes. I mean, they can really help. Um, that's just my, like I said, my overview. I'm just starting this book. I'm getting ready to start on chapter two tonight. And, and as we dive in a little bit more, I'm going to try to take notes. I'm usually not the best at taking notes while I'm reading. I usually just absorb, absorb more information if I just read it, but I'm going to try to take notes over these little 
sub chapters, I guess you'd call them, as I do it, and let kind of fill you in on what's going on with this book. Um, let you know if it's good or not, if it's informational, um, if I already knew some of this stuff, just like that. If you want to follow along, subscribe because I'll be making a playlist of this book and the other hopefully 11 books I read. I'm going to make sure I do it because it's part of my resolution. Um, and yeah, just let me know down in the comments below if you want to know anything else, if you want me to go more in depth, um, less in depth, shorter videos, longer videos, just let me know. There'll be more and different types of playlists coming out as I do this. Um, like I said, um, in my first video, cleaning up the property, going through books, uh, personal things such as like getting my life on track, you know, something like that. Uh, just just simple things I'm doing just to let you guys know how how I'm getting my life on track, how I'm taking it slow and I'm not diving in. I knew that there's no way I'm going to be able to read every single night. And I was thinking about doing that, but I decided not to. I'm not going to read every night. I'm going to get this book done in a month. This whole book I have this whole month to read. So I gave myself plenty of time, and I am interested in this book, so that's going to make it even better. Um, but yeah, just look forward to more videos about this, more videos about my property, some builds I'll be doing, some Jeep builds that I'll be doing. That should be interesting for you car guys. Um, just stay tuned and thanks for tuning in. Bye.